Okay, this is the MXL 910 mod mic kit. Currently, we're listening to this microphone off of a Neve 517 uh, microphone preamplifier with the compression and silk buttons disengaged. Um, today's date is March the 10th of the year 2015. And so the first stage of this mic mod test is to, well, first hear what it sounds like with its original components with my mouth about, I'd say it's about three or four inches away from the actual capsule or the, the, the microphone itself. The mic pre is set to 36, uh, which is the halfway point that this microphone, that the preamplifier goes to. And I just want to hear what this thing sounds like um, before the mod and after the mod. The first step, or this first recording, is with the 910's original guts. Capsule and guts, all original. Um, the second step will be to uh, upgrade the components on the inside, the electronics. The board is sitting on the workbench over behind me, and I've... Uh, got the parts from uh, microphone uh, parts.com and I just want to hear what it sounds like I want to see if there's a big difference so the second part will be just to hear what it sounds like with the new electronics in it the third part which we'll probably do in a month or so whenever I buy the capsule we'll then hear what the difference is with the guts and the capsule completely changed out of this microphone Again, this is a test, and I am hoping for the best. And again, I'll, I'll say my settings. Um, I'm using an MXL 910 microphone that I just bought from Musician's Friend on the stupid deal of the day. Um, it's plugged into a Neve 517 microphone preamplifier. That's a 500 series mic pre. Um, and then that's going out into an Apogee Rosetta 800 and then eventually into Pro Tools into my uh, Mac Mini. And this is with the original components, the way it was bought from musiciansfriend.com. Okay, well, hopefully we'll hear something uh, really pleasant really soon. Okay, well, have a nice day.
components with my mouth about I'd say it's about three or four inches away from the actual capsule or the, the, the microphone itself the mic pre is set to 36 uh, which is the halfway point that this microphone that the preamplifier goes to and I just want to hear what this thing sounds like um, before the mod and after the mod the first step or this first recording is with the 910's original guts capsule and guts all original um, the second step will be to uh, upgrade the components on the inside the electronics the board is sitting on the workbench over behind me and I've uh, got the parts from uh, microphone uh, parts.com and I just want to hear what it sounds like I want to see if there's a big difference so the second part will be just to hear what it sounds like with the new electronics in it the third part which we'll probably do in a month or so whenever I buy the capsule we'll then hear what the difference is with the guts and the capsule completely changed out of this microphone again this is a test and I am hoping for the best and again I'll, I'll say my settings um, I'm using an MXL 910 microphone that I just bought from musicians friend on the stupid deal of the day um, it's plugged into a Neve 517 microphone preamplifier. That's a 500 series mic pre. Um, and then that's going out into an Apogee Rosetta 800 and then eventually into Pro Tools into my uh, Mac Mini. And this is with the original components the way it was bought from musiciansfriend.com. Okay, well, hopefully we'll hear something uh, really pleasant really soon. Okay, well, have a nice day.